fighting. Oh, here we go. No, no, no. Here we go. Starting on the way. The same trying to ambush Buck, but no. Buck says no. Popping him on the outside of the ring. Running his head right in that apron. Ah, this match is getting off to a hot start. Wrestling fans all right into the ring post and the shoulder. I'll tell you what, Buck. He's got a lot of payback to do right here. With that big mouth of the Saint. Oh, chopping him right on the outside of the ring. Laying the leather in right there. And right here in front of the fans. Popping him right in the head with a big fist. Now Buck sending Johnny back in the ring. And Johnny says, hey, now wait a minute. No, and Buck will have none of that. No siree. This match here, this one has been brewing for a long time. Buck ain't, he ain't going to give no cease whatsoever. And the head right in the corner, Buckle. I'll tell you what, wrestling fans, Buck has been waiting a long time. He's going to pay back every penny, every single cent has been coming to the scene. And as he scales the ropes here, laying down the leather and the big fist right to the head. About six, seven punches right there. And Johnny tried for the reverse atomic. Didn't get it. Big head by Starbuck. Oh, and that shot. And the big reverse atomic drop right in the gonads and the family jewels. And Buck sending John McMetal in the ropes. And a punch right in the bread basket. And the Rebel hooking him up. Oh, big Russian side, Russian leg sweep. And Buck says, come on, boy, come on. Up and over the ropes. There he goes, John McMetal right down to the floor. And the Rebels standing tall. There's some form of retribution already taking place right here. I'll tell you what, Johnny McMetal getting his butt whooped by the Canadian Rebels. And Buck says, get back in the ring, you turkey. Get back in the ring, boy. He's coming out after him. Oh. And Johnny cutting off the Rebel. Blindside kick right to the abs. Now the Saint getting that blindside shot in. Popping the Rebel on the outside of the ring. They want this match here is breaking down. It's breaking down. On the outside of the ring now. Johnny getting back in, breaking the referee's count. Now this match is a grudge match, wrestling fans. Does not mean it's no disqualification, but it is a grudge match. Oh, and what a kick! Right to the head! Rocking the Rebel! Starbuck been known to have history of concussions, five concussions. Oh, another brutal kick right to the cranium. Five concussions to date in his wrestling career. You know that can't do good for a man and his health. And Johnny knows all about that. And he's for damn sure going to be capitalizing on that piece of information. Now Buck making it back up to the apron on his shoulder right to the bread basket. Big punch right in the head. And Buck sending McMetal into the curb turn, curb turnbuckle in the corner. Buck off the top. Oh, going for that clothesline. Johnny McMetal ducking out of the way. Nobody home. Nobody home. And Johnny laying in the boots to the Rebel. And another kick right in the chest. Right in that sternum, that cream. I'll tell you what, wrestling fans. There's a lot of bad blood there on Johnny McMetal's side, too. I'm sure he's got, he's got that burning remembrance in his mind about how Buck politically maneuvered him right, right out of the wrestling business back in 2006, fall of 2006. As McMetal laying them fists in right in the corner, kicking away, kicking away, and now choking the Rebel as the referee lays in the count. And this referee needs to get this match under control here. He's got to keep these men in control. Nonetheless, now Johnny skimming the ropes and laying the big fist right into the Rebel's head. Now, with momentum. Laying him in, laying him in. And Starla crumbles. I'll tell you what, Johnny's got to be a confident young man at this point in the game. The Saint, the love interest of FCF General Manager Will Wyszewski. And now Johnny getting ready. Head of steam, but no. Buck getting the boot up. Now in the corner saying, come on, boy. And a big clothesline out of the corner. 
Now Buck Scalen says it's time. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Big punches right to the head now. Buck into the ropes, right to the elbow, right down to the throat. Referee should have checked. Maybe that was a legal move, but nonetheless, Buck. Getting ready here. Hooking up the same. Don't go for suplex. Now. Oh, here we go. Slingshot. Shades of Tony Blanche, the four horsemen back in the day. Here we go. One, two. No. Johnny kicking out at two. And rolling out of the way. As Buck showing some frustration here. Body had him. That big, enormous slingshot suplex wrestling fans rocking Johnny McMetal. As Buck goes to pick up the Saint. Oh! And Johnny giving Buck a hangman on that top rope. Tripping the neck. As he looks to go up to the top rope here. Creates some offense and Buck, Buck up to his feet. Cuts him off. And a huge punch right to the jaw. McMetal losing his balance. Buck on the top now. Got Johnny. Here we go. Oh, like a sack of potatoes coming down. That's like a sandbag falling out of the heavens. And Buck now taking the leg. Oh, what's he got in mind here? Oh, oh, oh. Could it be? Shades. Shades of legendary 16-time world champion, Nature Boy Ric Flair. Yeah. Figure four leg lock. Buck is looking to put Johnny away. He's looking to snap his leg. Buck is looking to snap that leg. Looking for that submission now. Johnny, an enormous bounce of pain. You gotta be thinking he should have kept his mouth shut. All them years should have kept his mouth shut. And Johnny, who went on the TV show, reality show, Big Brother, shoot his mouth off even on Big Brother, telling people how much he hates the Canadian Rebel. I'll tell you what here, Buck going for that submission. He's like, oh, and Johnny right into the eyes, poked him with a thumb. And the Rebel, the Rebel's been blind and cannot see Johnny. His knee giving him trouble, but oh, Buck right into that buckle. And Johnny, oh, a huge cutter out of nowhere, too. And, oh, Buck barely making the kick out. Barely making the kick out. And this referee right here checking on Buck, but hey, what, Johnny, what you doing, boy? What you doing? That's a referee attacking the official. And I believe, I believe, FCF General Manager Wilmer Szleski just just declared this match no disqualification match We're in the middle of the match. Wrestling fans, this ain't fair. It's not a law abiding. All of a sudden, this match is no DQ. We need another referee. This match can't continue. Not like this. Now the Starbuck in the ring, getting pummeled by the Saint. Oh, dropping him on the top rope, and now Buck Woozy. Ooh, snapping him down right with that hard clothesline. And Johnny's got to feel confident. He's got this match in his back pocket because he's got the general manager vouching for him. Changing the rules in the middle of the game. Oh, here we go. New referee in the ring. This match now continuing. As Johnny choking away on the Rebel. And I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. This, we got no idea what's going to happen in this one because with Wilma changing the rules in the middle of the flow, we're going to have all kinds of trouble. I'm sure we're going to still have all kinds of trouble because nobody knows what's going to happen here. Oh, fuck, taking these hard shots from the roof.